the way the system was developed is uh, to sense seizures through tiny little uh, leads or wires that are placed right where that person's seizures begin. And the system is working in the background all of the time reading the brain electrical activity and then when something is sensed that is uh, abnormal or concerning that might indicate that a seizure is about to occur, a tiny pulse is delivered right at the seizure focus. Okay, so I talked a lot about input and output systems in cyborgness. This video gives you a taste, and it's really only a taste. There's a lot of stuff going on in this field. It really only gives you a taste for what about prosthetic processing? What about helping your brain actually process stuff? So in this case, it's a pretty simple system. The system detects when you're about to have a seizure, and then it, it, it puts a little pulse into that area, and hopefully that stops the seizure, right? That's a that's helping, that's augmenting your processing. In this case, they would consider it fixing your process, your processing, but imagine a system like this, and we're not so far off from that. Um, sometimes, and you know this is true, sometimes you can just take in a lot of information, you're really alert, you know everything you hear, you remember, and other times you can't get a single thing in your brain, right? I mean, no matter how hard you try, it just goes in one ear and out the other. What if you could press a button, and all of a sudden something similar to this happened, like a little part of your brain is stimulated, and now, while you're doing that, you remember everything and you know you're just up and so you turn it on at the beginning of lecture you turn it off at the bot at the end of lecture and you don't have to study anymore because every single thing the prof said you completely remember now, we're not far from that at all we're not far from being able to augment those sorts of behaviors um, or not those sorts of behaviors sorry those sorts of processing tasks where it's not really about you don't seeing any better you're processing better so this is this is augmentation this is cyberness of processing all right so let's you know, we're putting together all of these pieces. And right now they are all pieces. But let's look at a situation where, an imaginary situation, where all the pieces are now in place.